Hello, my name is Jan Lustrup, uh, ham radio operator LA3EQ in Stavanger, Norway. We've been doing some uh, listening on uh, VLF and LF frequencies and trying to monitor uh, signals, man-made signals from around uh, 10 Hertz to um, uh, 48 kilohertz. Uh, these l very, very low frequencies, they need large antennas. So uh, to accommodate us, we use the guardrail on a motorway. And uh, you can see here, on this shot, here is uh, Stavanger City. And this is Sannes City. Now uh, between uh, Stavanger and Sannes, there is a motorway. And there's an 8 kilo kilometer, 8,000 yard continuous guardrail going here. So we drove to the northern end, parked our car and hooked up uh, our transceiver and laptop to see what we could pick up. So um, we uh, received stations and um, here is the guardrail itself. It's pretty um, pretty long <laughs> and it um, did a, a very good uh, antenna job, that's for sure. Uh, the can uh, hook up by itself is here. You can see the coax cable uh, to the right. And this is a center leader or center conductor going to the right to the 8 kilometer long uh, guardrail. This is a, a shorter guardrail, about uh, 100 yards. We use that for grounding and the coax here. And uh, it worked uh, fairly well. And um, I was surprised of uh, the sensitivity of these uh, VLF stations. Here we're listening to England on 37.5 and uh, this is set up in the car, the transceiver on the seat and the laptop on top of that again. And a small E-probe antenna on the roof for comparisons. Here are some signals coming in and they were about 30-40 dB strong so that was uh, very impressive indeed. Uh, guardrail again. This was uh, at the night time and the traffic was low so it made them uh, much easier for us to uh, to listen in and see what's happening on these very very low frequencies. And we're using a Spectron uh, program. I can uh, let's just have a look at that. And here you can see uh, naval stations for submarine communications uh, all uh, set up here transmitting. We can uh, let you listen to a signal. There you go. And you can see the uh, display is jumping. There is some uh, atmospheric disturbances. That's lightning some places around the world, creating spherics and uh, making inter uh, uh, making noise on the receiver here. Yep. And uh, that was a very interesting experiment. So um, we enjoy that very much. So there's a lot to learn about the VH. VLF and LF frequencies.